A bus with its stop sign out, its lights flashing, being ignored by oncoming traffic this morning in Scarborough. Watch as not one, but three cars and a TTC bus blow past the school bus on Corporate Drive. Now, that viewer was sent to us from a City News viewer, and yes, what you saw just there is in fact illegal. And tonight, the TTC says an investigation is underway, and police say that all drivers need to relearn the rules of the road. A driver clearly frustrated watching oncoming traffic repeatedly break the rules of the road. One, two, three cars go by a school bus with its stop sign out and lights on. Then a TTC bus does the same. Kevin Quinn captured it all on dash cam video this morning on Corporate Drive in Scarborough. Usually to about two times, three times a week, there's at least one car that'll blow by going eastbound right past the flashing lights. And I, like I said, I've rarely seen professional drivers like TTC drivers do something like that. There's a higher bar set even for our own uh, operators uh, that, uh, that, that, that they drive safely at all times. The TTC confirming today they've launched an investigation into the driver. Our expectation uh, as a transit operator is that our all of our operators, bus, streetcar, even those driving non-revenue vehicles in the TTC, obey the Highway Traffic Act at all times. An act that says all traffic on a road without a median must stop for a school bus with its lights flashing. Only when a median is there are cars coming from the opposite direction allowed to keep driving. Just watch this. Tell me if you can see people doing something right or wrong here. After seeing that video, we wanted to know if Toronto drivers were a little rusty on our own road rules. So we showed them the same video. You know what, the, the flashing light is on and uh, I think traffic should be stopped in both ways. Oh, their guy just went through on the other side. They're not stopping on the other side? Aren't they supposed to stop on both sides? This type of problem actually is occurring quite frequently in the city streets. We've seen approximately 300 tickets issued for school bus related offenses. 300 tickets written so far this year. A hard and costly lesson for motorists. One this driver thinks the TTC could stand to learn as well. I just want them to educate their drivers that you know, it's not acceptable as a professional driver to be passing stop school buses like that. And the fine for people passing a school bus with its lights on, well, it starts at $400 and goes up to $2,000. That's for the first offense, plus six demerit points.